So this is one of the uh, Caribbean style of cleaning fish. So I'm gonna cut off this fin. Cut these off. Cut this bad boy off. I'm gonna leave the tail on because I think it, it should fit into the uh, pot with no problem. Cutting these off. These are some fiberware. I think it's called fiberware shears. These are sharp. Yeah, fiberware. Yeah, shears. These are sharp. Well, this is the Caribbean style. We want all our meat. Cut off those fins so I don't have to worry about getting stuck. Something about getting stuck with those fish fins. Totally different feeling from getting stuck by a needle or something. Jeez. It's that Caribbean style. Get all them scales off. Get the water hose here. good with a average size fish a lot of them doing with well a lot of them they do it with the uh, well it depends red snapper mangrove yellowtail whatever you have available at the time I, I've even done it with um, with the spec crappy so let me start off and get this knife here not going through that booty hole. I guess that's what that is. And I'll come straight out the mouth. I'll rip all that up. Like that. I just come in, I kind of split them open. I'll rip all that the inners out with the gills. And there's different ways of going about you know, cleaning the innards out of your fish. This is just one of the ways I do it. So, I mean, that's pretty much clean. I like to get most of the uh, I like to get most of stomach lining out. Then I kind of poke around in here and some blood that'll come out in the bones. Do it like that. Get that is good cleaning. Poke around in here. Get all the blood out. Then, you know, once you get it somewhat clean, real decent clean on it, you know, when you, before you prepare it and you season it, of course, you know, what my mom would do, she would clean it out with some lime juice. Oh, make sure you got a good cleaning on it because we cook these bad boy whole just like this here with some, with some red beans or rice or some white rice with black beans, but Preferably red beans and rice. You may have some boiled or flat fried planting with it. Then we'll make well this will be this fish will be cooked in some gravy. Well, we 
call it, sauce. And you have a little bit of spice to it. I'm gonna put some spice in that thing. But this pretty much clean right here. And um, try to go over it one more time. Try to get most of the scales off. Scales be hiding up in here. Scales in the eye. And one of the things you do is you do your three slices on the side or however much you want. That would allow the seasoning to soak up in there. Some people go the opposite way too. You know what I mean? I just do this to this one side. Do it like that. And you do the other side the same way. There you have it, that's that Caribbean style of cleaning your fish. You'll cook these bad boys whole in some gravy, some tomato paste, some tomato based. And that's it there. Hey, thank you all for tuning in for this little short one. I'll talk to you all later.